Good morning, everybody. It is our second day here in Chihuahua, Mexico, and we have some big plans for this afternoon, but right now we're gonna go get started with some coffee and some breakfast. I found two good spots near us. It's less than a 10 minute walk to get coffee and an authentic Mexican breakfast. So we're really excited to see what we're gonna eat. We've really been enjoying our time here in Chihuahua, Mexico, and it's been surprisingly calm. And our families, when we told them that we're gonna be coming here, all of them were freaking out and telling us how dangerous and crazy it was over here. And I think the general media consensus would be that it's dangerous and cartel warfare all over here, but it's been really nice and pleasant our whole time here. We haven't seen anything. And honestly, I feel more at danger back home in Albuquerque. We had a great meal there at El Gallito Mañanero. Uh, we both got some burritos. We got a chicken and a burrito. And they're both amazing and a really good red salsa there too. My mouth was burning but it was really good. They also had amazing tortillas there. We were just watching the lady back there making tortillas the whole time. They look so good and they taste amazing. I showed some of my coworkers that work in Mexico on the map where we're going to be staying and showed them that it was right off of this arroyo. And their biggest piece of advice to me was, don't hang out in the arroyo. I'll keep that in mind. We came back to our Airbnb to freshen up a bit and pack up to head down to Delicias, Chihuahua. We're going to be down there for the weekend, Friday through Sunday, and we're going to go see Yemi's dad's side of the family. Moses has never met my dad's side of the family and I'm really excited for him to meet them because they're all so nice and so sweet and the town Delicias is just an hour away from where we're staying here in Chihuahua. It's an easy weekend trip and it's going to be a lot of fun. We've been together for four years now so it's probably about time I meet her dad. Right now we're waiting for an Uber to take us to the bus stop, which is about $7 for the Uber, and then the bus down to the Iglesias is $25 bucks for both of us round trip. traveling by bus in Spain and Mexico. I'm hoping it's going to be a pretty similar setup. It's going to be a one hour ride down to Delicias and it's a very inexpensive way to travel. I've been on buses like these for longer rides and they're honestly really nice. It's nothing compared to the Greyhound buses that there are in the US. These ones actually like have little TVs on it and it's like comfortable chairs too. They also recline. I don't experience any of that whenever I did road trips out in the US. We're planning on traveling around Asia for a few months next year and traveling by buses right now is going to help us get used to uh, what we're going to be doing in Asia, a lot of train and bus travel. We made it to Delicias, now we just gotta get a taxi to our Airbnb. We made it into our Airbnb in Delicias and we're gonna go pick up a couple little supplies from a nearby Oxo, a little convenience store. Uh, we need some water, we need some snacks. And then we're gonna come back, freshen up and head over to see the family. like we stand out quite a bit. I'm freshened 
wound up. Now let's go see the family. When I think of Mexico, this is exactly what I think of. Last year I was here, I was still in school. And now this time I graduated and bringing home my diploma. I graduated college, not high school, I graduated college. Summa cum laude. Summa cum laude. We're having homemade ice cream. We hung out with our family for a bit and they took us around the Alicias to see a couple sites, get a little bit of food. But we came back to our apartment and got some delivery pizza and now we're gonna hang out and settle in for the night. I'm surprisingly tired as well, even though we were just on a one hour bus ride. But I think it's just because the past couple of days we've been sleeping kind of late, like we tend to do on trips. So this time we're gonna try to sleep a little bit earlier and get ready for tomorrow. We'll see you all tomorrow.